Thank you for your submission. Yes, the gluteus maximus has gotten either boring or easy for everybody because, yeah, as you put it, everybody knows where it is. And the other one that everyone has said easier or boring was the deltoid because it's in a nice name position. It's in the deltoid region. I can see why people have said that the biceps is boring. Everybody knows where it is, just this muscle right here. And as I said in the other group that thought it was boring, I like the brachialis so much better for some reason. I'm not sure why, but I like it better. Yes, the rectus femoris I think is easy because it's this big, meaty muscle in the middle of the leg. And as I've told the 12 other groups that have said this, I hate the pectineus with a passion. It's this two inch, inch and a half long thing right here. It doesn't like me. I don't like it. We are not on speaking terms, which is why it's not on your study guide. It's just too hard to label in all seriousness on all the models. But it hurts like heck when you manage to pull it. And then, yes, I love the gracilis because I think it says gracias. So I totally agree with you. So thank you for your submission. Oh, I forgot to. The palmaris longus. Can I click on it? I was right the first time. Hold on a second. So yes, it's very interesting. So there's the palmaris longus that not everybody has. It. It's going vestigial, just we aren't using it. And I hate to admit it, but I agree with you for the two ulna muscles. So here is, oops, I didn't even click on it right. I had to zoom in to pick it. My eyes are getting really old. So here is that silly flexor carpi ulnaris. And then we have the extensor carpi ulnaris right there. The flexor, I swear, is pretending to be the extensor just because of how it's wrapping around the underside of the ulna. So I totally agree this is so hard and annoying. So that's why I always count. So here's the first big medium muscle, palmaris longus. There's the flexor carpi radialis, flexor carpi ulnaris. Flip it to the back, move it so you can actually see what I'm doing. There is the extensor carpi, or the extensor digitorum, and there is the extensor carpi ulnaris, and then my brevis and longus of the extensor carpi radialis family. So look at the models, play with complete anatomy. They're well-named muscles, they're just so small, it's easy to confuse. Thank you.